Hey guys, please remember to subscribe and smash that thumbs up. If you guys want cheap and reliable ultimate team coins, be sure to check out footseller.com. I'll leave the link in the description. Right guys, what is going on and welcome back to Smash Tube. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys a FIFA 15 insane PS4 club tour. I'm sure you guys will really enjoy this. I've been really excited to bring it to you because this is like the best club I've ever had on FIFA. It includes loads of informs, man of the matches, other great players. So if you enjoy it, please remember to hit a huge thumbs up. So yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So guys, as I said, this is literally the best club I've ever had on any FIFA. It's not been the FIFA I've enjoyed the most in terms of actually playing the game, but in terms of just collecting players and building up more and more players and getting loads of informs and master matches and just really like cool looking players to try out, it's been a really, really great FIFA for me. So this club includes like loads of informs, like including second from Benzema, some other great informs, um, includes second from Lacazette, the upgraded version. Um, so I'm going to basically be showing you my actual club, so all the players, I'm going to show you my transfer list, so I've saved some of the uh, other players I used to have on there, some of them are really really great and some of them are good pack pulls as well, and I'm also going to be showing you guys some of my squads that I have in my uh, club. Right guys, so to start off I'm going to show you just the players I have in my club, so I have second in from Benzema, it cost me 900 and 60 odd K, really cool player to use. So if I haven't actually scored that many goals with him, but then I play people like first and form Griezmann. I'm probably going to get second and form because his first and form was really cool to use. I have second and form upgraded Lacazette who cost around 900 K. Um, he has four star skills and really cool stats. Now he's got an upgrade. I have second and form Aubameyang who's just really fast. That's pretty much why I got him for like sweaty sort of Bundesliga style teams with like Royce and people. Then I have man to match Lukaku as my first man to match. I have upgraded in from Lilana, in from Lopez, in from Guzan, in from Caceres, in from Williams, yeah, I think that was team of the tournament Toure, team of the tournament Aria, in from Ayu, um, in from Sanchez, um, man of the match Idea I think, uh, pack pulled in from Smalling, I have in from Wanyama, man of the match Atsu, the new 5 star skiller upgraded in from Balassi, who was actually quite cheap considering he's a 5 star skiller in the BPL. And then moving on to the normal players, I have Robben to start off with. You can see it cost me about 1.4 mil. I have Neuer, more so quite a few, uh, Dor um, sorry not Dortmund, Bayern Munich players, Schweinsteiger, Silva, Modric, uh, Bale in there, 1.2 mil. Sergio Ramos, who I packed the, just the other day. I have uh, Marco Royce, I have Cavani there, so I don't actually know why, I don't really use him. I have upgraded Boateng, who I, who I also packed the other day. Um, and I have Homos, Cruz, and then you can just see some other like Italian players. I have upgraded to Pogba, who I also packed the other day. Now Godin, who should have got an inform, but didn't actually get one for some reason. I didn't, I'm sorry, not an inform, um, an upgrade. It was quite weird. He didn't get an upgrade, but people like Lovren, who missed a howler like, over penalty the other day, he got an upgrade. But then you can see I have Alaba, and then just some other cool players. Martins, who is a really good like player. It was quite cheap to use in like a cheap Syria uh, team with people like Embargo in. So I'll show you uh, later. So Kratis, one of my favourite centre backs this year. And then you guys can just see I have loads and loads of other players. People like Nine Galan, Javinio, Sanya. Um, I think that's upgraded Carvajal. I think. Um, and just see, yeah, like, you can see like pages and pages of other players. I have the upgraded Kane in there. Um, but I haven't really actually tried him out yet. And you can see, see like loads of cool players. This, this page has just got loads of pace, like both the Abarbos there. Um, you can see his right wing version. I also had Javinho in my club, I just need to get Dumbia to complete that front three. Then I've upgraded for Kit and then some like really good non red players like Palacio and people like that. Um, if I just scroll back to Palacio, you can see he was like a really, really good player. His stats shouldn't actually, he shouldn't actually be non red, he should be a rare in my opinion. Like just if you look at his stats, they're really well rounded for the uh, first striker. But then finally, I just got some silvers because I have a silver squad and some like other silvers who are just in my club that like look pretty cool, and I might actually try them out. So yeah, that's basically like my club. You can see I have loads and loads of players. That's why this club is so like really like really cool because of like all the informs. Like you could really say I've got more blacks than like a KFC. Like that's how many informs I've got this year. Um, it's quite cool and some really cool silver including someone that looks like a cheap Royce there um, I think it's Verma or something 
and then bronze is just for like handicap reasons to put on my bench so I don't get handicapped in game. So guys moving on to my transfer list, uh, I don't actually know why that's there. Um, oh yeah I won a wager the other day so I just sold that and that and that's uh, fitness. But then you can see I got upgraded to Guerrero who I did actually pack. For some reason it says bought for, I didn't actually buy him, it's just, I sold him for that amount. In from Gutsa who I did actually pack the other day as well. Second in from Sanchez who I bought for upgrades like as an investment Bale you can see I've got a second from Lacazette who I bought for upgrade second from De Gea another second from Lacazette team of the year Silver and David Luiz who I bought when there was that big team of the year hype when the team of the year actually came out they weren't actually that expensive I could have sold them for a lot more now but they're really good for like petties at the back then I had Suarez like the vampire um, Bale, Robben, uh, the Ebra that you saw before was also packed so that was uh, pretty cool so guys I'll just show you my squads now so you can see this is like one of the main teams I use. So it's got Neuer, it's got like Boateng, Schweinsteiger, Hummels, Carvajal, Alaba, Ribery, so like the French links at the top, uh, upgraded Lacazette, Inform Benzema, uh, first Inform Griezmann, that's like an upgrade as well, and Bale in there as well. Then I have a uh, cheap Serie A sort of sweaty team that I was talking to you about before with like, that includes Mertens, Barbo, Insigne is really cool this year, such a like, really good player in game. Uh, I've like I think Chachi or Kachi, I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Um, Nangaland, De Rossi, uh, Chiellini, people like that. Then I have a League One sweat. So like these are just teams I use like in my free time playing FIFA when I'm not recording videos because they're really fun to use and people get really annoyed because like they're really sweaty teams. So like, you get a lot of rage quits with them. For people like Matuidi in there, David Luiz, Breathweight, um, Lacazette. So like really fun, like cool players. And that Lacazette has actually got a be better record than my inform Lacazette. I don't know how. Maybe it's something to do with handicap. But that Lacazette was really cool to use in game. It's not even the upgraded version. And this is basically the same as like that team I showed you before. But I just use bronze subs because I believe like there is a handicap on FIFA. I don't know if you guys think there is a handicap or no. Let me know in the comments if you think there's a handicap on FIFA. I definitely think there's a handicap, which is why I use bronze subs when I actually play. And this team, you can see I've got Royce. I, I sometimes use second and form of Bamiang in that team instead of second and form Benzema. Then I have people like Neuer in there again. So, like, standard defense that I use a lot of the time. Then here's quite a cool hybrid with upgraded Pogba, Royce, second and form of Bamiang, Robben, in from Caceres, um, Cruz in there, Marcelo, um, Balzagli, Schweinsteiger, Sirigu. So, like, quite a sweaty team, but again, really fun to use in game. But I haven't actually used that squad that much yet because I have so many other teams. And this is sort of a BBVA team I'm working on at the moment, which is just like packed players slash players I already had in my team. And sorry, in my club. So I didn't really buy anyone extra for that, but it's quite sweaty. And I haven't actually tried it out yet, but when I make it a little bit better, I probably will try it out. And this Bundesliga team, again, just players I had in my club or players that I packed. So people like Benati I packed. Um, but yeah, that's a 3 5 2 with like literally some of the best players from the. Um, in this league, I think I'm only missing Lewandowski for that team, and maybe like Lom in there, and I think Gertze, who I could get to make it slightly better. But then you can see I have this BPL again, players who I had in my club or players that I packed. That in from Smalling I did pack, but he didn't really go. For, he didn't really go for much, so I just kept him. I have that packed full storage in there. That man of the match Lukaku, because I think the man of the match cards look really great. So also let me know if you guys have any man of the matches and who you've used. I might try some of them out if they they played well in game. Then you guys can see um, that's similar to my first team, but just I it's got some like League One players, so like Lucas and Van der Wiel, and I think like Thiago Silva in there. And this is a full in form slash man of the match team, even the subs are man of the match matches. But yeah, that team is really really cool. I I just bought it pretty much because it looked good. But I will be uh, giving showing you guys a video soon of that full team on steroids. So hopefully like that you enjoy that video a lot as well and because it, it was really fun to use because in forms are just generally OP I found this year and so a man of the matches especially people like man of the match Lukaku so with steroid cards on them it, they were literally like so great to use so that's basically all my squads there that you can see um, so this is a really really cool club it was a PS4 club so it cost more than my Xbox club but uh, let me guys know if you want to see the uh, Xbox club tour it has some legends in there some man of the matches some in forms so if you guys could hit 15 likes like you always do then that would be great. I'll show you guys the Xbox uh, tour soon. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.